Hey everyone and welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you guys don't know who I am, my name is Mia and I'm a 12 year old who fosters kittens and I make content here on YouTube. I also have a TikTok and Instagram that I'll be trying to link down below. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about supplies that you need for fostering kittens. Sorry about the meowing in the background, that's just my foster kittens. Um, they meow every single time I start to talk, so I know it's a bit annoying. So it's hard to get this video not very complicated because you need a different supplies for different ages and for some ages you need the same supplies. So first I'm going to explain all the supplies that you need for every single age of kitten except the stuff you'll need for the setup. Like it's really hard to explain but um, I hope it makes sense. Also I will be linking everything down below. And and trying to pop up pictures on the screen, but I'm not sure if I have time to do all that since it is the day before I'm supposed to be posting this. So things that you need for all ages of kittens include things to clean with. I really recommend Rescue. You can either get their wipes, um, their spray, which I really, really recommend. I actually have that. You will also need, for every single age, a scale to weigh all of them. So for kittens zero to three weeks, their setup will have something like either like a tote or box, something really small to keep them in because they don't need that much space. And make sure if you're using a tote or a box that you don't have the lid on because you want them to be able to breathe. And then inside that tote, you can put down a blanket and inside of that tote, you need a, a heating source to keep them warm. I really recommend a snuggle safe. And then also you need a, you don't need this, but you can provide a snuggle companion. I really like this snuggle kitty because it has a heartbeat. Now to feed this kitten, you will need some formula. I really recommend either Kamar or Breeder's Edge. I, I heard that they're both really good. I've used Kamar but I heard Breeder's Edge is even better, or just use whatever your shelter organi organization provides you with. Then to mix up the formula, you're gonna want to use either a whisk or something like a blender bottle, which I've used, and it works really well. Then to feed the kittens, um, you can get a bottle, and you can also get, I really recommend, I haven't used this before, but I heard it's really useful and helpful is a miracle nipple because then you will not have to cut the hole to make sure the flow is good. Also to warm up the bottle, you can either use a microwave, the hot water method, which is where you take a bowl of hot water and you just put the bottle with the formula inside of it till it's a good temperature. Or you can use a bottle warmer, which I have. I still haven't used it, but a lot of people who foster kittens do use that. Then to clean up the kitten, you can use baby wipes. Make sure they're unscented. Also to stimulate the kitten, you can use some tissues. And to teach them how to groom themselves, you can use a toothbrush. Now for three to five weeks, I recommend getting a play pen. I really like the clear play pens. I also really like the other play pen that I've gotten. Um, and inside of that, you will still need blankets, a heat source, a snuggle companion, and you can include a hut inside of there, which I really recommend. And all the kittens I foster, they really love the huts. Or you can put a box on its side for them to go and hide in. They really enjoy things like that. You will still need a bottle, formula, something to heat up the formula in, things to clean them like tissues and baby wipes but you can start to include a shallow litter box and make sure it's non-clumping litter. You can also include some kitten safe toys. Now for kittens that are five weeks and older, you want to provide all the same stuff as I said for the three to five week olds, except at five weeks, you're gonna start weaning the kitten, so you will need some wet food. Also, a and make sure it's kitten wet food also, you will need to be providing them water, so you'll need kitten wet food, water, and a shallow dish to put in the wet food, and then a separate one for the water. Also, I recommend getting some baby spoons. And then you can also use dry food once they're ready for that. But other than that, for the five weeks and older, you'll still need the same things for the three to five weeks, like I said, except once they're fully weaned, you do not need to use the formula or anything that you need for the formula, like the bottle and all that. 
So anyways, that's all the supplies that I could think of. If there's any more, I will try to link those down below as well. Um, but I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!